Hi everyone, I am Dr. Sam Cozy, uh, the creator of Diffuse. My team and I uh, integrated lip sync generation, enhancer voice cloning, and advanced face swapping into Comfy UI. The mission is to provide AI creative artists with ability to generate dialogues for AI created characters. This integration is complex, so the installation for Comfy UI requires a few more steps than usual for installing custom nodes. By following the instruction in this video, you will be able to uh, install the custom node. If you encounter any errors, please feel free to create a discussion on our GitHub repository and we will respond to it. In the upcoming weeks, uh, we will be adding additional notes for lip sync translators, full video and audio pre-processing and post-processing. A lot of efforts goes into working on this repository, so any donation and sponsorship, we appreciate that. Uh, it will be put back into development of the repository. Without any further ado, uh, let's go to the installation. I suggest you install uh, this repository manually to ensure you can avoid any errors. The first step is you have to make sure you install PyTorch. Depends on if you're using virtual environment or Conda environment on your Mac. So you can go to the PyTorch.org and based on your operating system and the environment you're using, uh, you can copy paste the code. In this case, we're using a Conda environment and we're going to install PyTorch. Next step is to enable MPS, which is kind of similar to a GPU for uh, Windows. We have for Mac is MPS, so you have to copy paste this uh, code into your terminal to enable your uh, neural network engine. You have to install Dlib, the original one. It takes a while, so be patient. Depends to your machine. It might take even a few minutes. And then we're going to install a text to speech for voice cloning. This is a place you might get some uh, error, especially if you have uh, different versions of Python. So we installed this on Python 3.11, which is uh, the Python currently is being used for UI. And then after that, your system is ready, so you can navigate to your uh, custom node folder called diffuse from our repository, or you can directly download it and place it in the folder. And once it's done, uh, navigate to your UI diffuse and install the requirements. If you get any error in this stage, most likely is one of those uh, versions of requirements uh, file is uh, creating a conflict with the current installations you have. In this case, if you find the name of the package you cannot install, you can go to the requirement .txt file, open it with any text editors, and once it's open, so just remove the number and those equal signs and save it and install it and install it again. It should solve the problem. And next we're going to run the main.py and also make sure you install models manually from the link I provided and create a folder on your uh, models folder and call it diffu and copy paste those models inside your folder for google drive you cannot download a folder that contain uh, very large files i suggest you download them one by one to make sure you have all the models uh, downloaded and now we're going to run the code and because i created a brand new virtual environment and I wanted intentionally to get some errors. And I want to just like start thinking like a, a developer. So even developers, they get lots of errors when they uh, install something. 
So what we do, we normally copy paste that into internet, uh, Stack Overflows, or right now you can use uh, ChatGPT or any other large language models and copy paste your error and they will give you a solution. In this case, as you can see, after I run this, I get an error. So when I get this error, uh, there is a quick fix. So all you have to do is to uh, install another library, which is uh, related to uh, Hugging Face for downloading models. Also, in my case, I have to upgrade my transformers, which after I uh, apply this uh, to new installation, so when I run it again, so without any uh, error, I can uh, run my uh, Comfy UI. In, in upcoming videos, I will show you how you can uh, use uh, this set of nodes and also how you can integrate it into your current workspace and workflows to generate dialogues uh, for your videos. Thank you so much.